Hi friends, I'm doing a bird Rolodex today and I am using my card from YWAP Young Woman of Power card again that I have from previous years, still some of them that weren't sent out or extras made. I'm doing my bird shape with it and I was kind of looking at some birds and I was like, I'm inspired to do something springy today. So I decided to do a bird index card and that is the beginning. There's my bases of my bird. Um, and then I'm thinking like, what am I going to do? I wanted to use mixed media, do more of a mixed media type of thing today. So I thought I'd do some papers. Uh, and that's what I did. I just had some of my leftover papers. You've seen me play with these with my hearts before. And I decided to make, you know, cover my bird, make some layers and papers and that kind of thing and do some real fun pieces with it. So I'm using these old papers I've had for quite a few years now and using my glue stick from Elmer's and gluing the pieces on. I'm just cutting out as I go a wing and a little tummy red belly area. I love that on birds and uh, piecing it together. I was going to make a little tail, but I ended up being a part of like a, the wing. I just wanted that color in there. I really liked it with the checker type of um, paper. So I'm just piecing my bird together here and really loving it. I found uh, an eye for the button. So I got a metal button. That's the one I liked. And now I'm just doing these twist sticks. Um, these twist sticks are really nice. They move with your finger or you can add water and they move with water. So I really like them. They're wa water soluble. And I was just moving them along, trying to make it a little bit more, I don't know, a little different textures and stuff in there, visual. I used some gesso to blend in because gesso kind of picks up some of the color and I'm just playing back and forth with what I like, more color, gesso, more color, gesso, and that kind of thing. Wanted this bird to be fun and unique. So adding all these different colors. These twistables, um, I think you can find them at Target. When Target was in Canada about three or four years ago, before it closed down <laughs> and left Canada, I bought these um, twist sticks and I still, they're still kicking around. I'm still using them. So they last a long time and like uh, I haven't been using them constant. So they, you know, I'm starting to use them a little bit more now again. And yeah, I was putting brown on that bottom part of my roll decks and I found that it was a little bit weak so I ended up having to add another layer in the back of that so I just made another layer so then my card was double sturdy kind of a thing for the back so anyways um, you'll see me doing that I blew my button my eye, I blew on my button my eyes so there's I'm like okay this needs to be a little bit more sturdy my twig wasn't so sturdy and that's what I glued in the back there just to make it sturdy I didn't want nothing falling apart it's nice and sturdy now I'm happy with it so it was missing something I'm looking at it I'm looking at it. it's missing something so I'm just take my Puskas and doing some little dashes and whatnot and spots and I do the white around and a little bit of the black as well. And even after all this, I still feel like there's something a little bit missing. So I kind of go in and uh, I'm adding some little bark lines here. I think after I think I do that right after here with the thinner one. Yes, I do some little bark lines. I like it so much. I'm still looking at it and thinking it's still missing something. So I end up going back into my green craft paper that's on the wings and putting some leaves, some foliage on my stick. And then that just that's just exactly what I needed. I was thinking I was gonna put words on there or something, like a little phrase or a little word, but I decided not to and just leave it as my little bird. So I did the black edging and I grabbed that magazine which in the corner you can't see it but there's some, still some wet gesso there so I just right now I'm smearing some of the black I add a little orange at the edge I add a little bit of the gesso that was on the page brighten it up on the colors it was uh, 
that I'm gluing them on and I just like how they kind of come that's just how they look it's quite dimensional and then I do little dashes around with my black Pasca pen and then I grab my green Pasca pen and I do like the little vine uh, the little uh, uh, veins then I spray it to seal it just like the rest and that is it it's my cute little mixed media bird I hope you guys like this I had him down like on the stand, down on the paper, down on my stool. I got a few little pictures of him. So I hope you guys like it. Thanks for watching. Bye.